beautiful Miss Raven. Hello, my dear. How are you, Diva? I love this coat. Oh, you know, I had to wear my smart pink trench tonight because a lady reporter has got to be on point. And you look smart in it. Oh, thank you, my beauty. You're welcome, Diva. Give it up for Damiana Garcia. Oh, 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 please sit. Please sit. I want to say that I loved your recaps for Drag You Season 2. Why, why, thank you, beauty. I got to tell you, I was loving the show from home, so it was my pleasure to, you know, to give my two cents on the show. You're already a Diva yourself. You don't need Drag oh, You, honey. I don't need any tips. This lady, <laughs> she's doing it for herself. Sisters are doing it for themselves. You and Juju be on that show. You were just regaling me with entertainment, let me tell you. When I met Juju on Drag Race, she was the girl in right after me. And right when I saw her, I said, oh my gosh, that's my new best friend. I love her. I get vibes off of people. And so when I met her, we were friends from then and friends till the end. So we like to mess with each other. And it's just, it's sisterly love. When we go home at night, we're not going to cry about it. We have fun. We're entertaining. Entertaining. And then, uh, you know, we wake up the next day and we go to do an, another episode of Drag You. Look at my nail. These are an homage to Michelle Visage. Oh, lady, you are serving me nails tonight. No, I squared them off because she usually has like the more of, not quite the stiletto, but these are my Michelle, Michelle Visage. I love you, Diva. These are for you. She's doing it for you, lady. She I loves you. I haven't had to wipe my wipe myself yet, so we'll see how they oh. how they work throughout the evening. It's a little collateral damage by the end. <laughs> it's damaged something, girl. And hey, with Juju B, if, if some earrings have to get mopped, so be it. So exactly. be it. Exactly. And she's not here to take anything of mine, and she's also not here for me to take anything of hers. But when we are together, something always goes missing. There's some shenanigans. Yeah, I, a foot. I lost my virginity a long time ago, or she would have taken it. She loves me that much. Okay, she's loving <laughs> on you. A little kai kai. No, never hurt nobody. Ever. It's true. Oh, oh, lady. Okay. I I'm picking up what you're dropping down. I'll catch after the show. You're catching what I'm pitching, girl. Oh, yeah. And I'll catch some. Yeah. I'll catch some of those fingers. This wear, that wear, and all over the place. <laughs> Dummy <laughs> Anna, you're not. Oh, beauty. Let me tell you. But you are what you eat, right? Uh, you know, oh, I think some peanuts. I had some peanuts earlier. <laughs> uh, yeah, that tells you something. <laughs> yeah, that... People still think that I'm this crazed ice bitch, but I'm. I'm really not. I'm a sweetheart. I'm America's sweetheart. Right here. You heard that, Miss Tyra? Miss Tyra Sanchez. And I heard you two ladies are friends. Yeah, you bear the hatchet. Are. Yes, we are. Like, every time we work together, we're very spiritual. We pray before we go on stage every time. We have a good time together. There's no animosity or hatred there. Things panned out the way they did. It happened. It's done. I'm cool. I love it. I love it. The love between queens has not been lost. Ever. We never lose that. We're all sisters. And uh, that, that goes for every queen, everywhere, any part of the world. We're all sisters. Now, we got to talk about the big moment on Drag You when Raven met Raven. Oh, my gosh. Hello. Okay. I don't know who was more excited. I walked past her, and she, like, let out. And I didn't realize I was literally like, running outside. And I walked past her, and she let out this scream. And I turned, and I looked. I was like, oh, my gosh. And now we become... Really good friends. She comes to the show on Mondays. Raven and Raven are now friends. No, no, that. So Raven, I had to. I'm sorry, I had to. Oh, Raven. <laughs> I, I want to talk about this for a minute. I mean, we got, let's take it there. Okay. There, there are there are a lot of people who think that I've had the, you know all this work done on my face, and um, you know because I was on Pretty Hurts, and I've admitted to the fact that I get my lips done, and I had a little bit you know here, but they think that I've got my cheeks, my forehead. The best was Raven had silicone injected on her clavicle. I want everyone to know I've never gone under the knife. The only thing I've ever done is I've had my under eyes injected with Restylane and my lips. That's it. You heard here exclusive. We got the scoop. That is it. But if the time comes. Maybe a little more, you know. I was born this way, but I'm gonna keep it this way. So I've, I've done nothing, people. I'm all natural. Well, except for the lips. Oh, sure, sure, for the lips. Nails. Sure, but who's counting those? Lashes on top, I do Latisse on the bottom, girl. That's how I work. Okay, little Latisse, a little yeah. Latisse. Latisse, uh, girl. <laughs> That's right, yeah, 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 little Latisse never hurt none. I'll check but my gout. just get my asshole bleached. Is that so? Let's. Let's, let's. I've heard about this asshole bleaching and I didn't realize that people really did. I thought it was a joke and I found a place that does it and it's actually, it's not, I mean, I didn't really need it, but you know, I made a couple extra bucks this past week, so I wanted to go get my asshole bleach. Okay. Next week it's going to be a colonic. Well, you know, when I was broke, I was using Crest white strips to bleach my asshole to, and I thought that that would work and it didn't. So I tried the Tide pin, that didn't work either. So I thought, okay, I'm really going to try this asshole bleaching and you guys, everyone should try asshole bleaching. <laughs> And it's like, it's this color right now. Is that so? Yeah. It used to be kind of like this. Oh, oh okay. <laughs> and you 
have taken it to a different shade. Exactly, a, a lighter shade of pink. A lighter shade of pink. Oh, would you recommend that for this lady? Should I look into this procedure? I think, I think everyone should try it at least once, just to say they've had their their petunia bleached. <laughs> okay. When I next go into my cosmetologist, I'm requesting this. Try it, diva. Uh, I'll check in with you. You don't need these lips. Work on those lips. Sure, the back yeah. ones. The back ones. You gotta keep the fellows happy. The back door girl. Yeah, you, you wanna greet them with a smile when they uh, when they come knocking back there to the back they door. Do, girl, so I thought, you know, why not? Lady, you're keeping them smiling on the stage and beneath the sheets. And in the streets. And in the streets. <laughs> all over, all over the place. But lady, uh, you're living, you are living. I'm living my life like it's golden. And I'm living for you, beauty. I love you, Diva. Love you too, gorgeous. <laughs>